What do you think has been the biggest area of growth for the offense during this bye week? What have you guys identified and been able to attack? Uh, you just got to finish some more plays. I think a lot of the positive plays even, you know, runs that last, you know, we get eight yards or, you know, passing plays or like screens where we get eight to ten yards. Look, those could be bigger explosive plays. Uh, we just finished a few blocks or blocked the right guy. So I think that's it. You can see in practice the same exact plays. Uh, we might miss that block or we didn't finish that block. So I think we kind of identify that we need to practice better and that's going to translate to in what areas do you think you guys have practiced better in the last week and a half? Um, just up in the intensity, you know, whenever you get a scout team look out there, it's hard to, you know, you don't, naturally you probably don't want to, you know, bury them to the ground, but um, we got those guys playing hard and our guys going hard against them and they're getting us a better look. So I think that's uh, kind of key when we're getting the look of the defense we're going to get, go against. We need to get, you know, we need to be playing full speed. Do you think Kyle Hamilton's going to be the best player you guys see on defense this year? Um, yeah, I'm not sure. He's a really good player. Um, uh, I see him with that on tape. He's a great player. He's, he's projected like top 10, you know, probably one of the better, if not the best guys. Um, I'm not ranking him right now, but again, definitely, uh, you know, he's a heck of a player. What stands out about him when you watch him? Um, just I think his, the way he gets around for his size um, is pretty impressive. You know, I think he's like 6'3", um, but you would know that he's, you know, usually bigger guys are probably a little stiffer, don't move as well, but he moves really well for his size, I think. Two years ago, they came up with a pretty creative defense to try to stop Kit. Do you expect them to do the same thing to, to Drake this week? Um, probably not the exact same thing. Um, I think we have an idea of what they could do um, at times. Um, but, you know, it's not the same D coordinator, so I don't think we're going to get the exact same you know, three-double cloud look every snap. And, uh, but, again, whatever kind of look we get, we'll, uh, we'll adjust in the next few games. What are you most worried about with the Notre Dame defense? Um, you know, I'm not really worried about you know, anything particularly. I think I'm worried about or things that, you know, I'm concerned about or things we want to kind of take care of is um, just making sure we're dialed in our game plan and, and making sure we're comfortable doing what we do. You know, I think uh, – they do a lot of different stuff defensively, and uh, they do a good job of disguising it. But uh, if we go out and kind of uh, you know execute what we can do. Uh, that will be able to handle. This experience is a little bit different than some of the other road games. Obviously, a little bit farther travel. What do you tell some of the younger guys about this trip? I think the message mostly would be just don't don't get caught up to in the in the lights. You know, it's obviously a big game. It's Notre Dame. It's a rivalry. Um, it's our biggest rival, um, and I think uh, you obviously haven't won there in a while. But I think the biggest thing I remember as a freshman, we go out there and. Uh, halftime thing was like 20 to 3, you know, and you can't start off a game like that, especially in South Bend and expect to win. So, um, and I know a lot of guys, and probably myself included, and I remember Drake kind of saying, like, man, it was like a big environment, kind of got caught up in the lights. Um, and you can't let that happen. Obviously, it's a long time ago, two years ago, but that second half, I don't think you guys, I think you scored every single time you had the ball. Can you take anything away from, from that from two years ago to use on this trip? Um, maybe again, it's not the same team or same same defense, but I think just the confidence of knowing you can go in there and have success. Um, you know, obviously, gives us. Uh, I'm excited to play there. I know a lot of guys that played there last time are excited to play there again. We just have to kind of, you know, bring the what we bring here in practice onto the game field.